morning to everyone. We're here gathered here for the celebration of life of Mr. Ernest Alexander Hunter and Love and Mr. Strong and Jones Funeral Home. We ask the family to continue to look to the hills, which come with our help, all our help coming from the Lord above. At this moment, we'll have a prayer by Minister Marlon Blake. Let us pray. Oh, eternal God, we come to you right now just to say thank you. Thank you for life, health, and strength, God. God, I ask that you continue to bless this family and the friends of Brother Hunter. And God, give them the strength to go through this, God, because we know that this is not an easy road to take, God. Now, God, when it's all over and done with, God, we will answer the call just like Mr. Hunter did. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. Mm -hmm.
believe there are any resolutions, acknowledgments, which I would like to thank all of those at this time that remembered them in the passing of their loved one, Mr. Ernest Alexander Hunter, for all of your acts of kindness, your visits, your phone calls, whatever way you found to express your sympathy and compassion during this time of bereavement. The family would like to say thank you. And they will be getting in touch with you at a later date to express their gratitude in a more formal way. May God continue to bless and keep all of you. The family. little medley of song that I would like to share with you, family, in the passing of your loved one. But we know God is too wise to make a mistake, and he's too just to do wrong. We ask God's continued blessings upon you, and that he will strengthen you, and he will forever keep you. A hymn in the form of a medley that we're all familiar with. Very fitting and appropriate in times like this. Amazing grace. How sweet the sound that saved.
up with scraps of me. Don't let them fall. Father God, in Jesus' name, we thank you for your benevolent mercy. We thank you for your grace. We thank you for the Father for our life of this our brother that you allowed to be with us for 89 years. That in the person of Mr. Ernest Alexander Hyde. We thank you for his life. We thank you for the life that he lived. We thank you for the lives that he touched as he lived. We pray that you would give him rest. Not only for him, Father, but this family that's grieving today in the midst of his loss. Be with them, secure them, and keep them in your ever loving care. We realize, Father, that even on a time like this, thou art worthy to be praised. We give you praise, we give you honor, and we give you glory. We know that thou art a merciful God. Thou art too just to do wrong. 
now are too wise to make a mistake. Thank you, Father God, for this family, this Hunter family, and others that did not find it robbery to pay tribute and homage to this our deceased brother. Continue to bless this family in days to come. That they will be able to over, get over their grief that they're experiencing right now and the loss of their loved one, the sorrow that they are going through right now. We know that earth has no sorrow, that heaven cannot heal. Find up every wounded heart that's been affected by his passing. Thank you, dear God, for who you are. Thank you for what you've done. Thank you for what we know you can and will do. But again, we have to thank you for just being the God that you are. We give you praise. We give you honor. And we give you glory. As we come to the close of this service, bless everyone, Father, that has been a participant in this homegoing experience. Let's keep and preserve, I pray. Family, loved ones, friends, acquaintances. In the name of Jesus, we ask of no other, for thou art mighty, and there is no other. In Jesus' name, we ask these and all blessings. Amen. Amen. Thank you again, those of you that have come to pay your final respects to Mr. Ernest Elzheimer. At this time, I will turn it over to the funeral staff at Strong and Jones. Final remarks and comments. This concludes the service of Mr. Ernest Alexander Hunter and Love Mr. Strong Jones. We'd like to thank all the participants who came out to be with this service today. We ask to continue to pray for the family. Uh, the burial will be scheduled today at Tallahassee National Cemetery at 12 noon. If anyone would like to participate at 12 noon, they can just meet us out there. Once again, we say thank you for your participation. Oh. 